Welcome back everyone. This is going to be our final installment of Ground Garage 2.0. We got everything done and uh, we're going to give you guys a quick walk around of everything that we've changed and yeah. And if you want to see any of those uh, past episodes, you can check it out on our channel. Be in the card above, description below, whatever you need. But uh, we did uh, three parts putting together the shop. Um, first part was taking everything out. Second part was sheetrock. And third part was making all the cabinets and putting everything back together. So if you want to see any of that, link is in the description. But let's get to it. Yeah. All right, guys, so the first and biggest upgrade to this shop is most definitely this space. I have put the two cabinets together that I had uh, in here before that I took off of a job uh, and basically just filled them with tools. Uh, we've got the, those all cleaned out, and now since they're together, it's created so much more space. I've got a countertop off of another job that I worked on, and uh, it's actually pretty sturdy, not too bad. But uh, that is amazing because we have been working off this little tiny workspace on the work chest, I guess, and uh, it was just terrible. So now we got another space. We got the most important tool, the radio, and we got Stig, always in our videos, and then just a bunch of other random crap. Um, we've got plenty of stuff here that is perfect for what we need it for. We even have a little charging station for our phones, camera, whatever we need. So this. I'm very, very proud of it, and I spent a lot of time working on so it's definitely the uh, my favorite part about the shop. Moving right around, we got the Husky tool chest, and we actually uh, organized all the tools and got out a bunch of crap that we really didn't need and tools that we didn't really use that much. And then we actually cleaned all the tools, like all the sockets and stuff. It looks nice. And we got a nice Grom Grab banner, nice little addition to the wall finish it up and then we got these nice craftsman seats little stools I picked up because I'm always complaining about my back hurting so this allows me to sit down and be able to sit up straight and work on my bike and all that other stuff and in this corner we got my picture from the Smoky Mountain Crawl from last year which we were very excited for for this year so make sure to check it out i think it's june 9th and 10th out in townsend tennessee tail of the dragon so uh make sure to check it out and i uh, hope to see you guys there and this is my nirvana poster we also have this space here for our helmets we keep our helmets on top we put some padding up here so it doesn't scratch them up too bad and then we keep all our gloves anything like that um, if we want to keep our key somewhere those stay here Jackets go below, whether it's riding jackets or just regular jackets, whatever you want to hang, hang, boat bags as well. And then we also have fuel canisters right ready to go out the door just in case you're scared you're going to run out of fuel because it does happen. It happened to me. So I should have been carrying one of these. And behind the door, we got our nice uh, calendar of posting schedule that you guys can't see. <laughs> <laughs> and then we got all of our ratchet straps for when we travel and our extension cords with the uh, 3D printed hooks that I printed and then a light switch stopper since we don't know what it goes to and we were told not to turn it off. It, it goes to the outside lights. Oh, okay. Well, thank you, Kyle. Yeah. We were just told not to turn it off. So yeah. we printed off a little stopper so you can't flip it up. And this is an empty corner. Or is it? We got a heater up there, actually. And coming back to where we started, we got our fluids and oils up here, paints and other knickknacks and other jazz. And then we got our clean microfiber and our nasty grimy towels. And extra storage down here for Kyle's tires that he still needs to swap out. And our detailing bucket of stuff. And we might add more shelves later on if we need to see fit. And also add maybe some doors on if Kyle can acquire some from another job. Who knows? Well, this is like a work in progress area. Oh, and we've also got this space up here. All right, guys, and up here, we put down a piece of plywood before we did all the insulation, sheetrock and stuff, trying to plan ahead. So glad I did. 
we've got storage up here we've got uh grom parts we've got ruckus parts and we've got stuff i think it's appropriately named stuff so that's about everything you can think of whether it be japanese flags or anything you know jdm for life bro anyways we got all that kind of stuff up here cleaners different things we got the stock grom exhaust uh we even got Rick's motor. Uh, if you'd like to come pick that up, just call me at any time. I will be glad to bring it down for you. So that's pretty much it. Just uh, random stuff that uh, we didn't want down, down under. All right, guys, that's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed this reveal video for the shop. And if you guys are interested in how we did some of these steps, again, there are three videos building the shop. Um, if you're interested in that, is in, it is in the description. And in the card above, it will be on that side. And uh, if you guys have any suggestions for us, just uh, leave a comment below. Or if you have any other questions about us remodeling the shop, leave them below. We'll answer them. We're pretty good about commenting back pretty quickly. Yeah. So, also make sure you give us a like, subscribe, all that other jazz. Yeah. You know. That's pretty much it. Yeah. Oh, oh Twitter, Facebook, Instagram. It's uh, what else? Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram. Yeah, make sure to hit those up. We're still trying to grow on those, so uh, hit us up on those. If you, you forgot Facebook. Those. I did say that. Oh. Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat. Oh, Snapchat. Yeah, here we go. So yeah, make sure we'll uh, leave those down below too. Well. Grom underscore garage. Yes. Thank you. Take it easy, guys. Have a good night, all day, whatever time it is. Whatever. Have a good day. <laughs> I want to watch this.